Hello everyone! Today I will show you my new PvP gear. That build makes BK super tank by focusing on primary attack and shields. I have 5 different shields with that build, but could be 7 if I added Phoenix Ashes Gem and Familiar Dusk Prowler. I'm using Ward and Paragon Tree with that build. Before we go to build details, let's see some action first.
You saw how this build works in the battleground. Now let's go to the insides of that build. For my head, I'm using Voice of the Crescent. Shroud of Night also increases your invasion rating by 22.8%. For my chest, Momentary Comfort. Shroud of Night now periodically conscious shadowy apparitions that grant shields to you and Nebi allies. Shield effect increased by 10.8%. For my shoulders, Torture and Torment. Swarm of Bats now causes a small swarm of Bats to cycle you. When you use a primary attack, a Bat swaps down and bites enemies. Swarm of Bats damage increased by 18%. For my pants, Faces of Fading Meth. Swarm of Bats now also poisons enemies, causing them to take 5952 continual damage for 3 seconds. Damage increased by 90%. For my first main hand, the Beslave. Skewer now causes you to leap into the air and slam into the target location, knocking enemies airborne and stunning them. Skewer damage increased by 18%. For my first offhand, Hanging Chalice. After Shadow's Edge hits an enemy, two blades ricochet and randomly targeting nearby enemies and dealing 26,000 687 damage to them. Damage increased by 90%. For my second main hand, Cruel Vendetta. Shadow's Edge damage increased by 38%. For my second offhand, Spring of the Hawthorn. Skewer also increases your damage done by 19% for 4 seconds. With this build, I'm using 4 pieces of Untouchable Montebank and 4 pieces of Vitus Urge. My Helicrary I filled up with Fortitude and Willpower. Cast Properties 6 pieces of Nettled. After you gain a shield, for the next 6 seconds, every time you are hit, you will count attack dealing 40% of your damage to all nearby enemies. Additionally, damage dealt to enemies hit by the cont attack is increased by 16%. Cannot occur more often than once every 30 seconds. From Warband Room, of course Protector. As my familiar, I'm using Quake Strider as he has savior skill. His other skills and traits are very good for PvP too. That's how my stats looks like. As skills, I'm using Shadow's Edge, Skewer, Transfusion, Swarm of Bats, and Shroud of Night. Now, you know insights of that build. If you have Phoenix Ashes Gem, I would recommend to use it with that build. If you have any ideas or suggestions, how to make that build even greater, please let me know in the comments below. Thank you for watching and please let me know if you tried that build and your thoughts. Now, let's see some more action. Have an absolutely fabulous day and see you in the sanctuary.